Hello and welcome to Crystal's Bites in my kitchen. I'm excited about this episode because I'm taking on a challenge. This one was set by Emirates Chef Udo Leek. I just found out that you can access some of the recipes for the meals that are served in flight and this is part of the dessert, apple and raisin crepes. Now, I'm a little sad that I can't travel at the moment. I had planned a holiday for May. But that's not happening as you know we're in lockdown so if i can't have it up there how about i try it here in my kitchen so you can do so as well if you want to i will share my results with you i will share the link for the recipe with you and uh, you can use a hashtag emirates cooking challenge so it's apple and raisin crepes i do love something sweet uh let me get started I have my Granny Smith apples that are sliced, my milk, my sour cream, I have my all-purpose flour, sugar, some butter which will melt to begin, some raisins, sultanas, a bit of vanilla essence, four eggs, cream cheese, a cinnamon stick, and a pinch of salt. First with our hot water, we'll add our sugar, and then apple. I'm leaving the peel on and I'm going to leave that to cook in low heat. So as you can see my apples are boiling and um, they've been in here for about five minutes with the cinnamon sticks so I don't want to overdo it. I'm just going to take off the heat and get started on the crepes and the filling. So now I have added my eggs to the flour. I'm going to add the rest of the butter, which is melted as you can see. And sugar as well. And then I'm going to get this mix nicely combined. Okay, so our batter is nicely mixed at this point and we are going to add our milk that will make it a much looser texture so we can start preparing our crepes. Let's try to lower the temperature before I add the butter. And I put it back up. After the first few ones being eaten, <laughs> our crepes are ready and I'm now going to start on um, the filling. So now I'm plating, so I'm just adding my beautiful apples right here. Good amount of them with as little syrup as possible. Then I'm going to get some of the raisins that I added right at the end. And next, I'm going to add my cream cheese mixture. What I did is I added a little vanilla with some lemon, fresh lemon, and just a bit of the syrup from my apple compote. And I'm just going to put some of that right here. And then fold it over. Press it down on one side. Set up my triangle right there. Okay, 
so you can take a look at them. I'm actually going to drizzle some of the syrup now on top of them. So, since I can't have this up in the air, I am going to enjoy this. At home. Bon appetit.